Hi guys and welcome back. Uh, oh my gosh. This Are is we... a picture. Still. Yep. I mean, yeah. <laughs> but still, I mean, it's you know. No, it, it is a still. Oh, yeah, okay. Cool. Still frame. Well, anyway. well, welcome to loading. Oh crap. Welcome to loading bits. <laughs> The game where get used to it, cause uh these loading screens are long. Yep, yeah, I mean they. <laughs> Welcome they... to thirty minute episode, bitch. Ooh, a Final Fantasy for fans and first timers. I am super excited for this dude. <laughs> oh my gosh! So Square Enix. I bought. <laughs> yeah, go on. I bought this game, <laughs> kind of cautiously, cautiously uh, hopeful. Mm-hmm. You know. My whole mindset of it was, please be good. Please be good. Please. And welcome to the world of Final Fantasy XV. Yeah, seriously. Like, I can't really put into words how I feel about this game. You'll just so have to see. You're just Definitely. gonna have to yeah. watch. We're not. We're gonna. We're gonna try not to like you know go on and on about how we both legitimately really enjoy it but um you'll just have to see yeah we're wearing headphones because we actually want sound this time yeah we actually want to be able to hear what's going on (laughs) because the dialogue in this game is amazing anyways yeah let's uh get started the new game um did you know in my number nine in the um go ahead and just do this thing well real quick i wanted to make note that this game is so cool because it's it separates the tutorial from the main game. I'm so happy for that. So if you've already played it, or if you don't care for the tutorial, you can just totally skip yeah, it. If you just want to figure it. it out, it's not hard enough in the beginning to justify needing the tutorial, but hey, it's it's good to use. Yeah, I just want to say, wait, in a time unknown, only a prophecy keeps hope alive in people's hearts. When darkness fills the world, the King of Light shall come. Now four brave warriors begin their journey, prepared to fight. What awaits the four, however, they do not know. I just want to say real quick before coolness starts that um, Justin pointed out to me, he was like, did you guys actually listen to the credits of Mighty Number no. 9? And which we played, uh, obviously, but we've already beaten. And I was like, uh, yeah, we've, I was like, wait, no, actually, we didn't listen to the credits. Why? Not only is it epic music, but literally they have like hundreds of people saying, I'm Caleb Dickerson and I am Mighty. And it's the coolest part of the entire game. He's like, dude, you missed the best part of the entire game, the credits. And I was like, man, like... Yeah, it was because the game was over. Yeah, because <laughs> we were done with it. <laughs> oh, yeah. By the way, we did actually finish Mighty Number no. 9. Oh, yeah. That's a thing. So, so uh, real quick. This is the... Noctis. Yeah. That's Noctis? That's when he gets old. Like, jeez. By the end of the game, he's older. I'm fairly sur- certain that you grow up. So, dude on throne... Uh, is hi. he naked? Yeah, no, he's I got mean, he's he, got boxers yeah, on. Yeah, no, I I think he's got like fur, but yeah, I mean he's Stop dropping roll, stop dropping roll. <laughs> good old Prompto. <laughs> Come on, buddy, it's good. We're good. Come on. I uh well, as you as you may be able to guess, Prompto. William and I have seen all of this. So I I can't I have a hard time uh finding a character in this game I don't genuinely like. Yeah, it's um you got the four guys basically going on a magical, technological, road just trip. <laughs> crazy road trip. And it's this is basically what's going to be at the end of it. So I'm excited to see that. I just want to say real quick, I was laughing when we started the, when we started the recording. Oh, yeah. Josh brought... Oh, so we asked for water. We asked for water. And Josh brought me a water bottle and Caleb got the sippy cup. He he brought up a sippy cup for me. He was like, sorry, we're out of, we're out of bottles, but here's a sippy cup. And I'm like, oh, awesome. And I started sipping on it. And then he handed me a bottle from behind his back. He's like, I can't believe you started drinking that sippy cup immediately. <laughs> oh. Whoa. Oh, boy. So beautiful. See, that's why I was questioning whether or not that was Noctis. He looks so different. I mean, younger, I guess, is the better. Mm-hmm. I would say he's like late 20s there, and now he's early 20s. Because mm-hmm. he's, uh, he's about to get married. Uh, I um. guess to sort of, I guess, spoiler alert. Kind of, but not really. There, he's more or less talking about it right now, and we'll be talking about it. But uh, he's going to get married to this well, girl. Princes will be princes. Uh, <laughs> he actually likes her. She likes him, and no, so the relationship no, actually feels interest. genuine, even though the marriage is arranged as a political marriage of convenience. Yeah. You have to listen to every bit of dialogue to understand that this that's what's going on in this game. That's why when you point out that a movie came with this, um, apparently the movie gives a lot of like what's going on um because a buddy of mine was like you need to watch this movie and you need to watch the movie brotherhood before you play and i was like well i'll watch it when i can <laughs> i ask not that you guide my wayward son merely that you i'll i'll probably get around to that one i don't know 
Final Fantasy movies have a track record. <coughs> Do they? Mm-hmm. Or... It's not good. <laughs> I mean, Advent Children was okay. The anime was okay. The anime one about, uh... Zack was pretty good. Final Fantasy VII. What was the PSP game? Oh my goodness. I don't know, man. I'm just, I'm just paying attention to. I'm like, I'm just like sucked into the cuts here. <laughs> Caleb is lost. Yeah, I'm sorry. I. Uh, that, that's why I was worried about recording this game. <laughs> I like cinematic stuff. It, I like, and this is really good stuff. It takes a very special cutscene for me to not just hit start and then triangle right now. And just, yeah, just skip it straight up. I skipped so many cutscenes. That king is, like, <sighs> such he a looks solemn looks so good. They, they, you know from that angle alone that they were proud of that model when they were done with it. They were like, holy crap, the king looks great. <laughs> we gotta have one close, like, zoom in. Frickin' coffee, sippy cup, coffee, get your coffee, butt coffee, out of here. Coffee, coffee. Josh is here, by the way. Top of X, not... Okay. Oh, oh. Why you gotta crush my dreams? Why'd you bring me hot chocolate? You can't. I asked for coffee. <laughs> you cannot drink it because it has almond milk. Oh, dang. <laughs> my one weakness. Pecans. You, you guys are allergic Wait. to lactose, and I'm allergic to almonds <laughs> and pecans. I'm not allergic and to and walnuts. Or and Caleb, sometimes Caleb's peanuts. allergic to all nuts. All tree nuts. I'm yes. allergic to nothing. William's the one allergic Wait, to lactose. Wait, like you're not allergic to bush nuts? <clears throat> no. What about these nuts? I love these nuts. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> yeah, we gotta make this entertaining. So, actually, you can do the quick oh, yeah. reading, too. Uh, Prince Nautis Lucis, I can't even begin, sets forth on his homeland with the three men re retinue. Re retinue in tow. His destination, Altizia, a capital of Accordo, where he will formalize the Union of States through his marriage of Lady Luna Freya of the Imperial Province of Tenebrae. Mm -hmm. Tenebrae sounds like a uh, freaking... It's a musical term. Oh, uh, is it? Sounds like it. Tenebrae. Tenebra oh, we have said that like with full confidence. <laughs> yeah, I it's don't a like musical term. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. It could <laughs> be. Maybe I'm thinking of timber. Uh, Tenebrae. <laughs> timber. Well, it's not. <laughs> I'm the only musical timber. term. <laughs> it's going down. I'm the only Tenebrae. <laughs> Better move. Uh, by the way, this video is not gonna. Not that we make any money from any of these videos, but... Hey, we made about $5 in our entire time being around. And, and most of it comes from Shuffle Knight. Well, he says we made, we've made five YouTube estimated dollars. YouTube dollars, which means we won't shh, see... Shh. Why are you shushing him? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like in a YouTube Rude. <laughs> but, but, but... But... But I but love the scene. Yeah, but but, but but scene. But they can watch the scene when they play the Shut game themselves. Shut the fuck up. The point is, is yeah, that please buy this game. <laughs> the scene is the reason why Final we don't get monetized. What I was saying. Yeah. Oh, do you notice that the windshield's <laughs> dirty? I've already pushed myself to the brink. Shut up, Prompto. <laughs> <laughs> I just, you know, one thing that you said, and I just, I do want to say real quick, and it's very interesting, these do, these characters do seem a little one-sided in the beginning. You've got the smart guy driving, you've got the comedic effect on the top right, you've got the muscle guy in the back, and you've got the angsty teen prince uh, on the left-hand side there. Uh, but, <laughs> he's like, oh, it's not a phase, Dad. I'll be a prince forever if I want to. God. I mean, my hero's like the Prince of Darkness, yeah. so I mean, whatever. <laughs> Did I just say. Wait. Oh my god, it was. Like... <laughs> this is. This, this moment. Car! Oh! 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 oh. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Can you go, like, all the way into the oncoming traffic? Or I mean, I think that's the only car that comes. It is. Still. <laughs> can you, you kill, rewind and find out? Can you kill them oh, all? Man. <laughs> it's like slowly. We have what if Noctis, them all is actually canon? Noctis the Prince, Ignis, also called Specs. Yeah, the the smart guy. Prompto the comedian. The impromptu guy. And Gradius. <laughs> and the guy no one remembers, but we all know is the muscle guy on the back. Hardest name to pronounce. <laughs> that uh, that it's. I keep wanting to say GLaDOS. It's like Gladius, I think. Like Gladiator. I don't know. Galactose intolerant. 
up. <laughs> Just... No, you'd think that's bad. Wait until you see some of the puns in the game. <laughs> yeah. It was his turn. So Pumba, Pumba, Stan. That's not the right yeah. part. <laughs> Final Fantasy 15. Holy crap. Welcome to title sequence. Welcome to the official start of the game. 11 minutes in. <laughs> you know, I can accept this. Yeah, no, I like... <laughs> Honestly, if I was worried about monetizing, I would have skipped every cutscene so far. Yeah, it's not like... Not something it's not that... like we need to make money. I, right? It's not like we want to, like this to be a job one day, but... <laughs> yeah, we do. Uh, but the thing is, if we if we were that worried about monetization, you wouldn't see as much Super Mario 3D World as you see. You wouldn't see any Nintendo games. Because <laughs> Lord knows, Nintendo doesn't want us to make money off of that. We can, actually, if we join their uh, creators club. No, you can we make a percentage of money. <laughs> yes. Wow, we can really? A small percentage off videos. Oh, hi, the first uh, female character. That's cool. I'm sure they're not going to, you know... I'm sorry, the I'm just looking that, at this um, tiny piece of hello. fabric. <laughs> there was that tiny uh, piece of fabric. Uh, 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 yeah, I heard you're the, the best mechanic in town. Be best, best mechanic in town. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> but that plot. Sid's greasy, yeah. I'm in, I'm in the game for the plot. <laughs> but that plot, though. Cindy's side plot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, we actually have a Sid in the first ten minutes of the game. Oh my god, yeah, Final Fantasy freaking like tradition, throwing a Sid in there to be the mechanic. Usually working on robots and airships, but this time just working on our convertible. Because you know. I got, I didn't get too far. You know, in. I used to be, I used to try to be the Pokemon master back when I was just a young boy in Pallet Town. but unfortunately it didn't work out for me. So here I am working on convertibles in a magical kingdom. I went turbo. <laughs> <laughs> I shouldn't have gone turbo. <laughs> you aren't going turbo, are you? <laughs> Wreck it, Ralph. Oh, jeez. That, I love that. Oh, movie. my goodness. I don't know why I'm mentioning I love that movie. Hi. Uh, 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 so I heard. Uh, I, heard I don't know what to say. <laughs> what I've been told oh, is hey. uh, working with a hot mechanic has its perks. <laughs> really? <laughs> Just. Uh, <laughs> I can't even pun right now. I just I don't know what to say. <laughs> Maybe if you put on your trucker hat. Trucker. Yeah. Oh, I gotta say something about this game, though. Thank God they got a game that's meant for Southerners. <laughs> it is. As he just said, y'all. Y'all ain't never been this way before. Y'all take this map. They're Southerners. They're legitimately like. I mean, they just straight up. Well, I mean, this is, this is a kingdom. If everything was perfect and the world didn't, you know, have a bunch of... If everything was perfect, they'd all be Southerners? <laughs> well, and they'd all have scantily clad clothes. Thank no. God. <laughs> the way did no, I say that loud? What, what I'm trying to say is that this is... If a, the king was benevolent mm. and allowed technology to, to develop the right way... We'd have Southerners? No, they're like <laughs> serfs outside the kingdom. Yeah, I gotcha, I gotcha. I'm, I'm still trying to figure out how the southerners come into play. Yeah, if technology were to advance, we'd have southerners, obviously. Because there's, the there's, there's always people who don't adapt to technology. <laughs> yeah, there's always people who don't understand it. AKA southerners. Oh yeah, by the way, if you talk to restaurant guys, they show you everything on the mini map. Ooh, cool. Yeah. Parking spot. Parking spot for your car. That's Outpost. amazing. I remember the good old Final Fantasy points. games where you had to figure out where the parking lot was. <laughs> it, it's outstanding. Mm -hmm. No, this is this is Final Fantasy Road Trip Edition. Whatever happened to getting a freaking airship and going on a road trip on that? That's not really a road trip. That's an air trip. Okay, well, screw you. It's a cloud trip. First of all, second of all, screw you. Because I don't need that. I don't need that attitude right now. I'd like to go on a cloud trip. Frickin' shut up, Josh. <laughs> what? Josh, we'll let you back in the house. I'm sorry, I'll give you too many Like! Sitting so this way, man! I, I totally that. like to go on a cloud trip, man! <laughs> cloud trip? I'm cloud tripping right now, dude! Groovy. 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 Gladio. Like. Gotcha. Uh, this groovy gotcha. new thing called LSD, Shaggy. I love <laughs> Try it out. <laughs> I, I don't know, those kids Fred. were high. Those kids were so high. There's no way. Doc's talking, man. They were. There's no way they were all crammed in a mystery machine, and they all heard the dog talk. And 
No one else really talked about how the dog talked. The only other character that ever noticed that the dog talked was Johnny Bravo, and he didn't actually notice the dog chalk. He just said, you guys can understand him. Like, no one has ever pointed out that Scooby talks. Because he does it. That's why. Oh, Saber Dust. Not that I freaking know what Saber Dust is. I'm like, oh, look at that. Common breed. Uh, Saber Dust. Freaking look like uh, dogs, except for they've got oh, a no, saw no, blade. No, no. Mash, oh, wow. Mash, oh, my mash, God, look at <laughs> <laughs> I'm not the oh, I'm gonna give you kisses, I am. <laughs> Why is he cut me? I'm gonna kiss you up, I am! <laughs> oh, you look so tasty, though! What is it, Twink from uh, Paper Mario? You haven't seen that playthrough yet. Trust me, we have a cockney little star talking to us back in. <laughs> oh, we also have George Takai. George Takai is Princess Peach. Princess Peach. Has anyone. Has that oh episode. Have any of those re episodes been released yet? No, they have not. <laughs> okay, we. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert, we recorded Paper Mario. Uh, another another RPG. <laughs> oh, this is a, a fun RPG to look at, I think. Well, I enjoyed Final Fantasy 1 as well. Oh crap, we recorded Final Fantasy 1 as well. <laughs> Uh, oh my god, I've got all the cats out of the bag. Thank uh, god yeah, this is our... in there. Oh no, I'm in stasis. Do y'all? Am I the only one that accidentally says suffocates? I don't even know what that means. It's like when you suffocate, but you're, but you're hurting really bad. <laughs> I also, um, instead of saying definitely, I say deftly sometimes. Definitely. And Siri hates but me you need, for it. But you need to listen. I used to say library all the time. Library. But now I just don't mention it because I don't go, so it works. <laughs> I used to say library all the time. Then I stopped going. <laughs> now I don't have to say it ever. <laughs> Problem solved. You know, if you went to it more often, you'd probably say it right. Where's the plot? I back in town, <laughs> working on our car. <laughs> what <are> you... <laughs> I mean, what do you what do you want from me? <laughs> like... Where's the plot? Uh, sorry, I was just getting some money to buy. Back in town, working on. Sorry, I'm not about shoving a pig. First of all, second of all. Yeah, in the kitchen where she should be. In the God, garage. more like in the garage. In the doing garage. Her job. Yeah, it's like, oh, you doing a woman's job working on a car? Oh man, <laughs> such if, a woman's job. If women are like all the steel workers, blacksmiths, oh, hi, bridge repairs. Women. There's other girls in this town. It's just that, they, they, yeah, but not as interesting. But they're not as, Cindy. Yeah. But they aren't as interesting as the girl working at our car. She's so smart and her funny. Her name is Cindy. She has a name? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Cindy. Yeah, no, she's great. Cindy, daughter of Sid. I can tell you, you got it, I got it. Huh? What? Motorboat? What? what? <laughs> Something about a motorboat. That's, that's all I need. <laughs> I'm sorry? <laughs> uh, <coughs> I'm dying. Are you, done? are you done with our motorboat or uh, convertible? <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, can I just look for a second? <laughs> look at what? Nothing. <laughs> I gotta go. Oh, last time we entered this town, you know, uh, I entered the shop, we are gonna buy stuff. So who wants to listen to the Final Fantasy IV soundtrack? Prompt 2 was like, wait, what? In the car. You can listen to different Final Fantasy games. Holy soundtracks. crap, that's awesome! Unfortunately, that's probably not a good idea. <laughs> why? I want you to take one guess why it might not be a good idea to listen to a soundtrack. Because of copyright? <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, we'll get over it. Yeah! <laughs> Final Fantasy 4. Heck yeah. Which is... I want Final Fantasy 1. That... Uh, you make that joke? But uh, wait until... Oh, no. <laughs> you, you don't, he, he doesn't even know yet, yeah. does he? Oh, wow. Certain... Should I... Oh, God. We can also listen what? to Final Fantasy 1. Uh, uh, wait, wait. The story's getting interesting. <laughs> Yes, please go on. <laughs> mm, yes, of course. She's like, hey, you need something? Dude, have mm. you seen this? Oh my god, you're so interesting. That's my friends. <laughs> have, you, have you seen this? Have you heard about this? Strapped on cash? We're strapped for cash. Now I get it. This must be what Papa meant when he said he was going to teach them boys a lesson. You could teach me a lesson any day. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> nice good, um, <laughs> goggles. How about I? <laughs> uh. I really like your hat. Uh, boobs. I gotta go by. I don't know how to talk to women. <laughs> it's funny that, like, all the other characters in the game can be completely normal with it. But it, it's like... Well, see, the thing is, you know... We kind of know why she's in the game. I mean, 
And I hate that the first female character you see in the entire game, like, but like, at the same time, I, I don't want to say I hate that the first one looks like that, because at the same time, you know, there's just some girls that just straight up look like that. And like, that's... Really? I haven't met one yet. <laughs> Have you been to California? Shut up, Josh. <laughs> Let me make a point. The point go, is... Go for a walk in California, Memphis, any city. Well, I mean, no. like, one of the first guys we see is Buffy Mick, you know, Brinch benches a lot with his, op like, his open shirt and Can stuff. Can we count the abs? Yeah. <laughs> one, two, three, Oh, how I love four, you. Five, Let me count the six. abs. <laughs> what? One, two, three, four, five, thick. Thick abs. <laughs> Oh, hi, buddy. This time. Oh, I love the little icons at the bottom. That's yeah, that's, amazing. It's uh, <laughs> the little very reminiscent. Very retro. I love it. Very reminiscent of Final this? Fantasy 1, which we recorded. Have we started posting that yet? No. Yeah. Wait, oh, we, have? we have? Have we? Yes. I think. Yes. Have we? We have the thumbnails, and I know that for sure. Well, they're uploaded. They're I don't think they're posted here. yet. Stay tuned for Final Fantasy uh... 1. So we're starting with, we're doing a, a remake of a remake, but the original, and then the latest. Yeah. To us, there is no in-between. Yep, there is no in-between. There is Final Fantasy 1, says and me, there is Final I'm... Fantasy 15. <laughs> says me, because I'm actually going to be... What about 7? Shut up, Josh! <laughs> Get back in your corner. Thank you. Yeah, we haven't started posting Final Fantasy 1 yet. We've really? been posting Tearaway, Mighty Number no. 9, and Sly Cooper. So. Well, they got a quick, Whoops! <laughs> quick sneak peek into our plans. Into the future, yeah. Freaking. Future! By the way, I was just doing some quick upgrades. Everything's Chrome in the future. Not according to Final Fantasy. Oh, yeah. by the way, sorry, I keep getting the pause. Everything's convertibles. So, the there's something I want to look. I want you to look at, I Caleb. Bottom left corner. Cool. You see where it says Princess uh, Fatigues? Yep. Look below it. Stats? Yeah. Oh. Your Is costume. It... Oh, the costume really does affect the stats. Mm hmm. Interesting. So the uh, fatigues with no jack would probably be the best, I think. Well, that will yeah, give you no, higher fine. attack but and lower... higher stab, but lower health. Mm. Honestly, it's a good bit stronger, but I th like having high HP. Yeah, the health is nice. Uh... That's really cool. You could actually. Not only like change their stats, but you actually change the way they look. I really like that. Well, I hate when games have like, you know, armor stuff, but it doesn't change how you look. That's more of a retro game thing, but still. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, he leans oh. into his walk. It it looks real nice. We're moving into one of the most tedious just, <laughs> tedious part of the game. I'm sorry. I just, was, I just wanted to walk up to the girl or pop to be like, and the plot thickens. <laughs> it's like. Stop. <laughs> Prompto is one of my favorite. I like characters. how I threw that on Prompto like I like like he was saying it and not me. <laughs> like uh, man, he, but you should have heard what he would what totally sexist say it. comment Prompto said the other day. But he would totally be the one yeah, to say it. Yeah, I would say. I mean, out of all the four characters, he definitely would be the uh, go-to for that. Uh, so right now we're just kind of doing battle stuff, learning how to parry. Uh, <laughs> Ignis, well, no, you get bonus experience if you do. It Ignis like this. is doing cool poses for some reason. I think he feels like he's in the Matrix. But um, uh, if, have you looked at him? In the Matrix. Yeah, the he, he does look like he's in the, the mattress. mattress. Yeah, he's in the mattress. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I feel so cool. In Come out. Here. Do you use a six six six? Mr. Attack. Cruz. Whoa. Oh yeah, that's that a cool. that's a twin strike. Whenever you. Uh, Wait, he has a twin. No, no, no. So you can and you can do it. Why would he strike his own twin? Because he wouldn't shut up <laughs> and let it let the older twin shut talk. up, twin. <laughs> you aren't even my twin. You're yeah, like, Josh and William are actually twins. Totally. He just came three years later. Yeah. yeah well, my little brother was born on my birthday. I mean, my fifth birthday, but he was born on my birthday. It's true. So he was born, like. X number of months. I can't really count that high right I, now. Uh, <laughs> however, many 12 times 5, which would be 60, but that still. It was the worst birthday present ever. <laughs> freaking, my fifth birthday sucks. What do you mean? <laughs> He's probably freaking out. Yeah, freaking. Imagine being, imagine being a five year old, not seeing your mom for like the last like day, having to spend the time at your aunt's house, which by the way, used to have an Nintendo 64, which was really cool. But she sold it when the kids left. 
So imagine sitting at the house all day, being a five-year-old, wanting to watch TV, but your uncle wants to watch NASCAR. Shut the heck up, I'm, I'm ranting here. Oopsie. Ooh, yeah, ignore the that. technical bits. And freaking, then imagine waking up early in the morning to go to the hospital for everyone to not tell you happy birthday, but to be concerned about this little baby boy that was just born. I mean, I didn't understand it. I didn't freaking know what was going on. I just knew people was ignoring me on my birthday. Caleb's life story. Freaking worst birthday present ever. You know what the... the... And we shared our bedrooms anyway. for like... 12 years, we shared birthdays for like 12 years, we shared everything. You will always like 12, share birthdays. 13 years. Well, shut up, parties. And finally, I was like, you know what? Can I have the room upstairs? And I did. And it was an amazing, it was an amazing thing. Shut up, Josh, this is about me. This is all about me. You know what the sad thing is? I need my sippy cup. <laughs> you know what the sad thing is about all this? Nothing has changed since you were five. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> that was early. It's hard to drink out of sippy ow, cup. Ow. Kudos to kudos to all the babies out there that watch Robits that drink out of sippy cup still, because because we are totally a show for babies. Yeah, I have... slash immature teenagers. Yep, slash forty. Go pronto. Yeah, I was gonna say 40 year old women, but that like was getting into weird territory for me to just say that randomly. So Caleb, like... there are no cougars in this game. <laughs> yeah. Uh there's only scantily clad 20 year olds stuff. No, there's only monsters. There's no regular animals. Josh! Caleb! Why'd you have to make it sexual? You're the one that's making it sexual! <laughs> Freaking We uh that was a skit we did on Calibre Gamer. I don't know if you ever saw it. I don't I'm I'll not editing this, the... so <laughs> whichever one of you two is going to be the one editing this, yep. you can put a link to that video if you want. I don't okay, care. Cool. Oh, um, they have this new weird annotation thing, so we well probably I'll probably figure it oh, out. Oh, is it but... the new slide card things? Because I noticed annotations are starting to work on cell phones. Yeah, an... some of them. Well, okay. The thing is, annotations don't work on mobile. However, the they have this new card. They have the cards and they have the in slates, both of which do work on mobile. The only problem is cards are kind of hard to work and they're kind of finicky. And in slates literally only work for the last like 30 seconds of video. So they work great though. I mean, they link you perfectly and they pop up on your phone and it looks awesome. But uh, oh wow, they're just, I, I feel like they're not as perfect as they should be. I love when Prompto attacks things. Yeah, it just pulls out a gun, like a magic just gun. Fired. That just... <laughs> well, that's actually explained. So, that's part of their power. Shut up, Josh. Josh. shut <laughs> up. Like, please. Seriously, please like, think. it's not even funny anymore. <laughs> shut up, Josh. Hey. He's Meg. What a Meg thing to do. He's not, not even a Meg thing, it's just a Josh thing. <laughs> Yeah. Alright. <laughs> but, uh, what were you saying about the weapons? How that even... So, it's really... I want to hear it, dang it! They <laughs> don't. Yeah, well, shut up! I didn't ask you! Maybe they do. They wouldn't know if yeah, they Yeah, freaking, I love movie. people explaining things randomly and tediously, so shut the heck up, Josh! Well, Caleb said yeah, magic gun, you. and that's not really too far How does it work? Really quickly, explain it. So Alright, you, you said... ran out of time. <laughs> Go on. No, I ran out of time. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, yeah, I mean, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. Oh, uh, jeez. Speaking of running out of time, we're uh, getting pretty close to the end here. Oh, jeez, and then maybe Josh can shut the heck up and actually edit a video. <laughs> what are we looking at? This creature is known as a saber toss. Yeah. Oh, oh, is that right? Is that is that uh? You know, the other day I asked Josh to edit a video, and he said that he was happy to do it, but only uh, if I only if I paid him tree fitting. And then he was just about that time I realized that Josh was a lightning monster, and I said, Josh, take it. You can be the lightning monster, but you gotta edit Robin's videos. And he was like, Well, I just need tree fitting. And I'm like, I'm not gonna give you tree fitting. You don't edit enough. Not, you don't edit enough to get tree fitting. <laughs> Sorry, Josh. Yeah. Tree fitties for the earners. <laughs> Tree fitties for the people that edit. More than a once a week. You're getting out of school soon, so... I'm pretty sure... Do you work a job? 
Yeah, you won't have an excuse. <laughs> he plays 10. Oh my god! You didn't hear it, Josh, but he we is. just ended the battle and Promptu goes. Promptu went. Yeah. I'm looking for you. Yeah. Have I not really had. Have I explained why I don't edit enough yet? Go ahead and explain it right now. I, and next time on BroBits, uh, <laughs> we'll play more of this game. So thanks for watching, guys. See ya. And uh, we'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye. BroBits.